book. I've been busy. Brad and I released a book. We traveled and met lots of awesome people all over the country. Our book? It's been on the New York Times bestseller list. Six weeks in a row. But none of these things are even the biggest news. The biggest news? You're looking at Uncle Kim President. That's right, Brad behind the camera, he got a daughter, and I got a niece. She's so cute, she smells like birthday cake, I love her. <laughs> now look, I have a lot of work to do. I don't know anything about girls. You wanna go Hawaii? No. Yeah, it was a fail. I wanna be the best uncle on the planet. To do that, I'm gonna need some help. So I'm calling in the uncle expert. Comedy legend, Steve Martin. Hey man, how you doing? I'm talking to comedy legend Steve Martin, right? I guess I, well, I don't know if I'm a comedy legend, but I'm definitely Steve Martin. Well, good, because I need your help right now. Uh, what do you need me to help with? I am now an uncle, so I need an expert uncle. Oh, you know, there are no books on how to be an uncle. So that's where you come in. I'm an uncle, and I didn't know how to be an uncle, and you just hang out with your uh, nieces and nephews, what man. I mean, you just hang out? Mm -hmm. But I want to be the best uncle on the planet. Uh, well, I'd say always remember the birthdays. Uh, drive over and visit them every once in a while. I can't drive. I'm 11, dude. Oh, well. Man, you make it sound easy. I want to make my house a home for this little nugget. I think that involves the people. So you don't have to change anything about your house but you do have to have a warm, loving, and caring environment. I got that, but I want to make the baby laugh. What's the secret to making a baby laugh? Uh, you know, babies laugh at anything. You can go like this, and they'll laugh. <laughs> <laughs> You're a really smart dude, Steve Martin. Is there anything that you don't know? Ah, uh, there's so much I don't know. Well, what am I calling you for? <laughs> you can never know enough. You could have never absorb all the things there are to learn. Is there anything that you wish you knew when you were a kid? Oh, so much. I, I guess the main thing that I wish I knew when I was a kid is everything's gonna turn out all right. And you look back and you say, what was I so worried about? Diapers, diapers, man! Diapers, I don't think you have to change a diaper. Somebody else will do that for you. Yay, you don't have to do it. Do you think you can help change the diapers? You know what, I couldn't quite, I've got a bad connection here. Oh. <laughs> Perfect. <laughs> Well, bother me up and call me a biscuit. You helped me a lot, Steve Martin, but I have a question for you to ask everyone. The world would be more awesome if. Oh, the world would be more awesome if uh, everybody started treating each other in a kind uh, way. Perfect answer, Steve Martin. Talking to you makes me want to dance. What is, hey, you got a banjo there, man. Cool. Yep, yep. Can you play it? Nope, nope. <laughs> I need you to teach me some time, Uncle Steve. Uh, anytime we're in the same neighborhood, where are you right now? I live in a tiny Oval Office. In what? Oh, okay, yeah. <laughs> That's good. We don't need to know which city. That's fine. I'll just go around <laughs> to the different cities and find out. Thanks a lot. Bye-bye. Bye. Bye, Uncle Steve. Woo! I put this away. Oh. Oh man, it feels good to be in the Uncle Club. Thank you, comedy legend Steve Martin, for all the advice. Feeling so good, I think I have to do my uncle dance. <laughs> uncle Kid President, out. So, we're freaking out because we got to talk to Steve Martin. Stevie! One of my heroes. I love him! Steven! Steve Martin is a voice in the new movie, Home. Home. Yeah, he looks a little different in it, though. Yeah, the movie, uh, that's not me. That's an actual animated character, but that's how I look at night. Hello. Well, how did you get a clip to play? You just, like, say that and it comes up? Yeah, I'll do it again. Hey, Steve, tell us about your new movie. It's very enjoyable and uh, filled with a lot of action and adventure and touching friendships. Steve, I've been one of your biggest fans for years. Did you enjoy talking to me? I feel like a what? I couldn't quite, I've got a bad connection here. So, Brad, you have a daughter. And you have a niece. Yeah, and she's perfect. You're going to be a great uncle. You got nothing to worry about. Except diapers. Thank you for making our book a New York Times bestseller. You can uh, order your copy by clicking over here. Plus, well, you kids didn't even know about our book. 
Yeah, some people don't even know that we wrote a book. You guys do not pay attention. <laughs> <laughs> and we've now made over 80 episodes of Kid President. You can watch them by clicking here. And if you'd like to see a clip of Robbie singing Butter Me Up and Call Me a Biscuit, a song he made up while we were filming this, click here. KP and Brad out.